One of the Valley's largest employers played host to a group of aspiring engineers today, offering the chance to see the car making process up close. 27 First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti was able to tag along as the students took part in Manufacturing Day. It's something most of us will never have a chance to see, but for nearly three dozen local school kids, it's a rare learning opportunity. We got to see with a lot of things that we deal with in school. You know, we work with a lot of the programming. We work with robots a lot. These students all attend the Mahoning County Career and Technical Center. As part of National Manufacturing Day, they were given a tour of the GM West plant in Lordstown, where parts for the Chevy Cruze are made and pieced together. Plant engineers explained how workers and robots work jointly to build one of the automaker's best-selling models. The robot that you have here is the same that we use in any of our other manufacturing sites across the world. And within a matter of months, these students will have robots just like these at the Career and Tech Center as part of a joint effort between the school and GM to train what could be the next generation of auto workers. We're also training the next generation of the engineers, uh, the welders, the precision machinists that are going to not just use the robots, but build and design the robots as well. Many of these students plan to pursue some sort of engineering career after they graduate, and being able to watch it happening this close with sparks flying all around only serves to pique their interest. It kind of broadens like and opens my eyes to like what we've talked about like last year and like this year in school about like the the whole manufacturing process. In the end, spending a few hours today could be what helps inspire tomorrow's workers. In Lordstown, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.